titty beats, let's go Rubber bands up in my hands, ain't nobody gon' top this Diddy on the beat, so my whole team getting on this Touchdown celebration, post it up on offense If you didn't know, we ain't fucking with the nonsense, no Hey, back for a minute, take it all in, gonna rinse and replenish Spitting bars to the moon and the stars been back in the game, you should know this Whipping around the city in a cherry Monte Carlo Preaching to the choir like some Sunday morning gospel Taking shots and ducking on my team, we never run Hey, what's up guys, it's Big Smitty coming at y'all with another video and it has been a very long time. I feel like it's almost been a year, maybe? About? Or so? I don't know. But man, it's been a long time since I've been on two wheels. I have not ridden since my last video. And I'm telling you, it has been killing me, guys. I have missed it so much that it is just absolutely unreal. Um, but I am going to be back making on more videos. I'm going to try to shoot for one a week, if not one every two weeks. Because I'm still a little more uh, small channel life. And because uh, i got, you know, life and responsibilities and, you know, normal life stuff. So this is me. Back. Big Smitty 918. Look at it. Woo. I love this bike. But anyways... It's a 06 uh, ZX14. I'm sure you guys can tell if most of you know bikes uh, the, by the cluster. Guys, I absolutely love this bike. And I'm not, I didn't get it to be the whole I'm better and faster than everybody on the street game whole situation. I got it because I legitimately wanted a bigger bike. And I know everybody can say you could have got a, a thousand, a liter bike. Yeah, I've had thousands, but. I'm a bigger guy. Obviously, I'm not like, you know, giant, but I'm a bigger guy. I do like big bikes because I feel like it suits me better. Oh, crap. I need gas. Shit. Uh, but I like big bikes. I feel like it suits me better. Um, and it is by far one of the most comfortable bikes I've had. I mean, this is even more comfortable than my Harley. My Harley was actually pretty uncomfortable. Any more than 30 minutes, my ass was hurting. And when I bought this bike, I actually drove up two hours to get it. So I, actually, I had to ride it back for another two hours. Yeah, you know, don't mind me. Just trying to make a U-turn here. If anybody could make room. <sighs> my girl thirsty. Well, aren't you something? Oh, well, great. Here we go. But, anyways, yeah, so I had to drive about two hours, picked it up. Oh, Jesus Christ, everybody's getting gas. I had to drive two hours, pick the bike up, and then ride it back two hours. So that was my, like, ultimate test of trust because everybody knows once you first get a new bike that is used, especially from a Craigslist or Facebook deal, it's a little sketchy. I mean, you don't know the person. You don't know the bike. You don't know anything about it. So, I mean, there's always those risks. And and I took that risk when I went about two hours. <laughs> so, but it did great. It performed awesome. When I got there, you already had it up on the bike stand. And we, you know, we went over everything, checked all the fluids, checked the air pressure. Uh, he filled up the tank for me on the, for the ride back. I mean, he gave us fresh pecans and fresh cherries, all of us waters. And then he told me to give him a call when I got home, make sure everything went smooth. And if I needed anything, if I, anything happened on the way home to call him, he'll come pick me up, trailer me home. He was some older guy, but man, he was he was awesome. Yeah, but you know. Nothing much has changed. Just been working and supporting my family. I don't know if we talked much, but I got guardianship of my little brothers now, so got two little kids and I'm quite young to have two kids. <laughs> it's been a very big life change. You know, it was pretty much 
me and my wife we take them or they go to the system and I was not gonna let that happen so we went through the whole court system and got everything figured out and I got guardianship of them because I wasn't gonna let my little brothers get raised up like that if they didn't have to it's been a huge change I can tell you that guys right now though <sighs> and it's hot as balls just in case anybody was wondering I just want to go home but I hope you guys like that little two-part video of the bike before when I got it and then you know the few things I did to it obviously I didn't do a whole lot I did the screen the mirror block off plates the shorty levers the stabilizer and then I put some uh, little pegs up so I can put my stand on a lot easier I mean it wasn't a whole lot but the biggest thing was the stabilizer because I mean I didn't make a lot of videos with my sport bike but I do like to go fast and when I do it I'd like to be safe because this didn't have a stabilizer and I have you know two kids and a wife so I want to be as safe as I can but still have fun you know with my own ways and that will help me be safe so and it's GPR so it's a good one it's not one of those cheap knockoffs so yeah trust me bank account knows it wasn't a cheap knockoff if anybody's had to buy one they know but uh <clears throat> but yeah oh yeah let's all just oh yeah Jesus Christ let's all stop and of course your dumb ass makes it where I can't even go. Oh, Jesus Christ. Bitch, quit looking at me in the mirror. I hate when people stare. Oh, and then we got another guy cutting people off. Just in case. Hey, <laughs> bitch, I'm gonna get in front of you. <laughs> You know, guys, I'm about home now. I'll go home, make some dinner, hang out with the fam. But, uh, but yeah, guys, I'm back. I'm gonna be out making more videos, try to get on some events or get some group rides going. Uh, maybe meet up with some old people I used to ride with because it's been quite some time. But, uh, but yeah, you know, guys, always like, comment, subscribe. It's gonna help me out a lot. I'm, I'm slowly still been climbing up on subscribers, even though I haven't been making videos. But, uh, I'm, I'm gonna be back, alright guys? I'm gonna keep making videos. I know I pretty much fell off the planet whenever everything happened. But, uh, there was just a lot of stuff going on, so it was just, it was just best. Obviously, you guys don't know full details, but it was a big situation. And it was just easier to hold off for a while. But, uh, yeah, but this is Big Smitty, signing off. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.